What's up, Pack members? It's the Warrior Spirit the Alpha here, and welcome to our next and also our final Kingdom Hearts 3 Keyblade Showcase episode. In the last episode, we took a look at the Oathkeeper Keyblade. Totally awesome. Do not judge a book by its cover. And this is going to be our final Keyblade Showcase, and it's going to be none other than the Oblivion Keyblade. So here it is. Looks totally awesome. Or once again, you know, it has that very dark look to it, so that's pretty awesome. And just so you know, to get this keyblade, you're gonna have to struggle a good bit. Well it depends on how good you are at this game, but to get this keyblade, I actually just got it, you know, not long ago. First like how you do it, you gotta beat the game on a critical mode, which is the hardest difficulty level, and believe me, it is hard. I mean, the final boss was brutal, but you know, then again, you'll figure out your own strategies as time goes on, and I'm surprised I actually managed to do it, but, so yeah, <laughs> Oblivion, let's see what it can do. There's the Oblivion Keyboid. <clears throat> so, yeah. So, as you can see, for... Wait. Sure are a lot of walls. So, as you can see, for the Oblivion Keyboid, pretty much, you know, the Oathkeeper and Oblivion are pretty much almost the same thing. The only difference is, is you know, Oathkeeper has light form, Oblivion has dark form, but, you know, in slightly different normal shot lock attacks, not maximum. Maximum they do the same thing. You know, they both have the double weapon form, and, you know, both of them have the same finisher. So, if you ask me, I think both Oblivion and Oathkeeper are both amazing Keyblades. So, honestly, my favorite Keyblades in this game right now are definitely Ultima, Oathkeeper, and Oblivion. So, you know, the three main ones, and as you can see, I actually, you know, have those three Keyblades all equipped up here. They're pretty awesome. 
So overall, that actually wraps up every Keyblade in Kingdom Hearts 3. Also, it would be cool if you could get the Keyblade itself, you know, the Keyblade that Master Xanuel used. But, you know, then again, that would be kind of overpowered, I guess. Where the ultimate's already overpowered. But, whatever the case, that just not wrap up this way. So overall, I think Kingdom Hearts 3 is an awesome game. The Keyblades are totally awesome. And until next time, this is Spirit the Alpha, signing out. I'll see you guys back in the pack.